Motor Week is made possible by Auto Value and Bumper to Bumper and TireRack.com. Meet Tucker number 44, one of only 50 Tucker torpedoes produced by automotive entrepreneur Preston Tucker in 1948. This innovative design, known internally as Tucker Model 48, was advertised as the first modern car in post-World War II. This is our new automobile, the first completely new car in 50 years. 75 years later, we're taking it out for a drive. A Franklin helicopter engine is powering this rare car worth $3 million. It's pretty surreal to be in Tucker 44 cruising around Morganville, New Jersey. I'm here with Preston Tucker's great grandson, Sean Tucker. Sean, you tell me this car is pretty difficult to drive. Not that easy. I asked to drive it, but no. <laughs> <laughs> it, can, it can be a little nuanced if you've never driven a Tucker. Blame that on its pre-selector shifting system, which adds to driving anxiety behind this one-of-a-kind Tucker. It's, it's an honor, but in the moment, you're really more just nervous <laughs> than anything else. In 2017, car collector Howard Kroplick bought it at auction. It was his dream to own a Tucker. I buy these cars really to expose people to the history of the car. And this car, when you bring it onto a field, it's, the looks there are amazing. You know, that, that wow, it, what is that car? There are no seatbelts in this car. So if we were in an accident, what would I do? <laughs> well, <laughs> there is a crash compartment that's in front of you. And this is, this is one of the Tucker uh, safety features. But the idea is that you would see an oncoming you know, accident about to happen, and you would dive into this chamber that's in front of you. Yeah. And in an accident, it would protect you. Your reflexes would have to be almost supernatural. Some of the safety features are a little hokey, but make you think. Others set the standard for today's automobiles, innovations such as aerodynamic styling. When Howard bought Tucker number 44, it needed a full restoration. He teamed up with the Tucker twins and restoration expert Rob Ida to restore Tucker 44 in only eight months, just in time for Pebble Beach. Usually when we're restoring an old car, we're dealing with rust or damage, um, and it's usually a condition problem. With a Tucker, it's more of a build quality problem. It took hours and hours and hours of research trying to figure out exactly what are we restoring back to, and when those parts weren't available, could we find them? Um, and if we couldn't, that's when my brother would get involved and, and we would make them. Using old blueprints, the Tucker team produced the most accurate Tucker in existence today, Tucker number 44. It was awarded second in class at the 2018 Pebble Beach Tour de Elegance. From the beginning, the Tucker brand was more than just cars. It was about daring to dream and pushing the boundaries of what was possible. 75 years later, the Tucker team is fully embracing that mantra by tackling two new big projects. A full-on restoration of Tucker number 29, which was Preston Tucker's personal test car while simultaneously using old renderings from 1955 to build the first Tucker sports car, the Carioca. It was Preston Tucker's dream to create a unique sports car with steerable fenders, a dream that is still very much alive today.